it's an adjustment, but I think everyone's trying their hardest. Um, I chose to live here because the district is so close to campus and 4th Ave and downtown that it's super convenient. But I'm really happy. Everything's brand new, so I can't complain about that. The only problem I've had is that it's a little loud sometimes, but I've managed. I try to participate in like community events like the 4th Ave Street Fair is coming up or Tucson Meet Yourself and just like go to local restaurants and little holes in the wall and kind of um, interact more with Tucsonians. I know a really popular thing is students will like go try out different like gyms and like yoga studios and stuff around the area. So that's one thing. The district doesn't really do much as far as events go, but they do send out emails kind of reminding us that we are residents of a community that's more than just students. I do think it's true that we live here, obviously, during the school year and we spend a lot of our time here, but it's still a new place to all of us and we're getting familiar with it. And we all probably prefer our homes where we grew up, where we spent 18 years of our life. Up. We had a, um, a meeting with the uh, owners and builders of the district um, after they had quite a, a loud weekend. And there were a number of, of neighborhood people there. I mean, there's a lot of concern, but trying to bring students into um, a feeling of uh, being part of the neighborhood, I think, is a little bit um, futile. They're never really going to, they're, only, they're always going to be transient. Uh, a po transient population and I don't think they'll ever really feel like this is their neighborhood or they're really a part of the neighborhood. It's very difficult for them to split their time between being a student and a resident of a neighborhood. And I, I don't think it's, it's realistic to, to really see that as happening too much. I think students are students irrespective of where they're living. I mean, there are parties going on in Phoenix, in Yuma, in Prescott, in NAU, in Flag, and in Tucson. I think it's just a matter of let's set some ground rules as a city, as fraternities, as a Division I institution, and as students self-governing themselves as well. Uh, it, it's, it's, I, don't, I don't think it's a, ge it's a geographical thing, and I don't think we have different standards in the city of Tucson than you'd see in Flag at NAU or in Phoenix uh, in Tempe at ASU. I think it's just a question of all the, all the parties coming together, all the stakeholders, the residents, the students, the institution, the city, and saying, how are we going to live together? Reasonable people will come to reasonable conclusions when they're sitting in the same room talking to one another. <laughs>